at school I was very interested in different things in nature and, uh, and the very important background was that uh, pretty young, something like 13, 14 years old, I start working during summer times in, in boreal forest, in forest like that. And uh, in, in these days I also look clouds, but uh, there was no idea that I will be a scientist. We are now here in, uh, in Hytela at Smer 2 station. This is the place uh, which is the backbone of all my studies. My research is to find out that how this changing climate uh, really works. What are the dynamics behind aerosols, uh, how aerosols, uh, atmospheric chemistry, trace gases, greenhouse gases, different biospheric things are related to each other. We are aiming to tackle problems uh, in molecular level and the earth system level. And uh, certainly to use this multi-scale approach in all, all ways. When we are studying climate change, uh, the problem is that huge. That uh, there is no one person or one laboratory or one discipline or one country who can alone solve the problem. I like work with Marku because he is very open to new ideas and encourages people to test their limits. He's not fixed at all uh, at his own ideas, but he's rather always looking for new people, new ideas, even new fields to work with. In my point of view, there is no way to make high-level science without high-level teaching. Uh, the new students uh, give uh, to me uh, and the other senior scientists new inspiration and it's some kind of continuous learning process. And uh, I have also developed new way of studies, which means that I collect students uh, and uh, assistants and other professors uh, with me. And during those courses we try to solve something which hasn't been solved before. I have a couple of uh, sources, for my, sources for my motivation, but one important is certainly nature. I like a lot of walking around forest, being in archipelago, working, uh, working and thinking. If I would not be a scientist, uh, I would very probably be a taxi driver. And uh, in both, both uh, professions, there is some freedom. How, however, uh, to be a little bit more serious, I think that uh, for me to be a scientist is certainly the best possible profession. Since uh, somehow after, after being schoolboy and after studies in university, when I started own research, I immediately find out that this is the place where I fit very nicely. Mm -hmm.